Hi, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to auto read your FBX 3D models. For example, now I have this FBX file. I want to use it in my Icon 3D animations. However, this 3D anim this 3D models still don't have any of the rigs. It it don't have the skeleton don't have the skeleton so we must rig this avatar first before we send send it to iClone for this time as demo I will use the Mizamo use the Mizamo to auto rig this 3D character this is the Mizamo website www.mizamo.com before that you look at this file, this is the FBX file, you should be able to see the file extensions because during the workflow, we need to be very sensitive to the file extension, what is this file type, whether it is FBX or OBZ. If you still cannot see the file extensions, you can move your mouse cursor down, right click, right click the file explorer and click file explorer click view, click here, click view again, make sure you untick height extension for non file type so that you, sh you can see all the file extension. Next, this file you want to auto rig it by using the Mizamo. I close this 3D models, I go to the Mizamo website. Mizamo.com Next, at the sidebar here, you can see Upload Character. Click here. Drag in your FBX character. And wait for a while. And here you can click next. Then here you need to put in the position. Where is the wrist? It's somewhere here. The elbow, the knee, and the groin. Somewhere here. Next. You need to wait for a while. Now it's auto rigging process in Mizamo. It will take some time. Just be patient. Alright now, you can see this character already finished rigging. Here I click next. Click next. Here you load your character right here. Then you just need to click download. Make sure here you select T-Post and click download. Preparing download just a moment, it will appear right here. If this is the Google Chrome, the Google Chrome browser. Now finish downloading, I click here, click show in folder, this is my download. So you can see, the, it used the same file name as my original file. So I, I'm going to rename this, this is girl, Mizamo, read. So now I put this on my desktop. Look at the file name, you will know this is your original FBX 3D models without the skeleton, without the rigs. Now this one is after I rig it in Mizamo, I download it as a fully rigged character. It already contains a skeleton. Now I can close the Mizamo. Everything already finished. Before you send it to iClone to make it become an iAvatar, 
you need 3D Exchange 7. Drag in. Make sure you click Import Animation so that the T-Pose will be imported together. The T-Pose is very important to convert it to become an I avatar in iClone. Here, click OK. This one, select No. Now we check the character size. We don't resize it here. We convert it to become a non-standard human first. Drag here down. You can see this character already in T-Pose. Drag until you can see here. Convert to non-standard. At this moment, click here. Choose Maya Human IK. Click Active. Now, click here. You can have some preview, like the basic run, preview, then stop it. Basic walk, click preview. Everything seems normal and it is quite okay. Here I stop it. And we check some of the finger calibration. Now this character already fully rigged. Have the full skeleton. Stop this. And check the head calibration. Have a preview. Everything same. Perfect. So now I just stop it. Back to the T pose. Have a preview. Here I click convert. Now, now I already convert it to become an I avatar. Click OK. It already become a non-standard human in iClone. Next, you can see now the iClone is already open. Here I click apply to iClone. Back to your iClone. The 3D Exchange 7 already sent this character to iClone. Now, it already become a non-standard avatar. I'm going to save this avatar. Click content. Click here. Click custom. Click avatar. Now I click plus. Now, this one I already saved. Save as a new avatar that I can use it anytime at any moment. And of course, now this avatar, you already can apply some of the motion files. And as demo, I will just put some demo motion, my custom motion. I drag in some of the motion file. This one I put a different motion. Yes, here I click template and I select some template, template motion file, like mix move. Now you can see both avatar can receive the motion file. Hello. Yes. All right. So Second by Brava. Upon blurring here. Okay, okay. Terma Kasi, Nadi Saibudin. Thank you. So now you can see three of three of the avatar ready set.
I already set this as, as new avatar under the custom. And this is how can how can I use the Mizamo auto rig like just now? Use the Mizamo auto rig system to rig the 3D models, rig the 3D avatar so that you it can perform the 3D animations in iClone 7. And this is the whole process. How can we convert the rig the fully rig character? into icon 7 to perform any animation and save as i avatar and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these video tutorials are helpful to you you can subscribe to this youtube channel remember to turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new video tutorial you receive the notification immediately see you in my next video